Okay, right. We are going to do our do now. It's a vector question. I don't want any of this. Oh, I don't get it. I just want you to get stuck in. Have a go. Remember, positivity. So you're going to have five minutes to, to do it. I shall start the clock in a second. It wants you to find... Let's talk through the question. Why not, right? So vectors df and de are shown in the diagram. So df is from there to there, and de is from there to there, and they are shown. Line pq is three times the length of EF. So there's EF. Well, okay, so we're going to need to find out what EF is. PQ is just three times that. Uh, PQ is in the opposite direction to EF, so it goes the other way. At find PQ in the form of MA plus NB, so where M and N are just numbers, so something A and something B. Yep, off you go, five minutes.
three, two, one, blast off, let's go. Right, well first of all, PQ is three times the length of EF, so I need to figure out what the vector of EF is. So going from E to F. Now I can only follow the vectors I'm given, we know that. And the first vector I need to do is go along this route here, so going in that direction. But that's against my arrow. So it's the same vector as this, but negative, right? So I'm going to do the minus of this vector. So minus of 3a minus 2b. Then that will get me to d. And then I need to go along this route here, which is, I'm going to add that into it, 2a plus 5b. It wouldn't matter if that's in a bracket or not, because it's all just adding. Well, the negative on here in front of the bracket is going to mean that that is now minus 3a, but I'm doing minus minus 2b. So if anyone slipped up, it'll probably be there. It's plus 2b. And then we're going to add the rest of that vector on at the end, which leaves us with minus 3a plus 2a. Well, that leaves minus 1a, so I'm just going to put minus a. And then 2b plus 5b is 7 B. Okay, now you might have written it like that, but of course we quite often do like to sort of put the positive thing at the front and the negative thing at the back because it just looks a bit neater, so you might have written it that way around, but either is correct. Now PQ is in the opposite direction to EF and it's three times the length of it. So if I want the vector of PQ, so P to Q, it will be three times the size of this, but also in the opposite direction. So that's going to mean I need minus three lots of 7b minus a. Or if you could have used the first version of the thing with minus a plus 7b. Uh, let's multiply this out then. So minus three times seven is minus 21. So that's minus 21b. And then minus three times minus a, it's that double negative again. It's plus 3a. So that one would get you full marks, but obviously, as before, I always like to write it what I think is a slightly neater way round. So we put the positive thing at the front, 3a, and then minus the 21b there. And that is the vector of PQ, three times the size of EF, and going in the other direction. Okay? Right, off to the main part of the, your lesson, you go fly by pretties, fly.